and welcome back to my channel. Today we are at another National Trust property. We are at Tatton Park in Cheshire. So hopefully it'll be a good day out. There is a house, a bench playground, a farm. So hopefully it will be a very good day and we thought we would take you along with us. So we are just in the farm, there's like a woodland play area. I'm a bit cross that in our National Trust handbook it just mentioned about the £6 for parking. However, you have to pay, it's half price to get into the farm if you are a National Trust member. So we promised the kids obviously the farm, so we had to pay £9.50 to get in the farm. And to be honest, I don't really think it's worth £9.50. There's not a great deal to see. We have a farm in our local area that is about £7 an adult, and there is a hell of a lot more to see there. So I am a bit disappointed that it was not mentioned in the handbook that you have to pay. Um, we're going to head up to the house after this bit and I'm hoping that that is included in our membership because we did have to pay £6 to park as well which that was mentioned in the handbook but like I said the farm admission wasn't so I'm just hoping that we do get some perks to our membership at this property like to get into the house or the garden so I will keep you posted about that but the playground is really cool um, there's an adventure playground like out of the farm which is free um, but this little playground is in the farm and it's like a little obstacle course for older kids 
and there is a little mud kitchen for younger children so I will keep you posted on the house and garden price situation if you are a member and you might be coming to this property then I will keep you updated on that this is quite cute actually because it's Edward's first experience of like animals and farms and stuff and he's really been loving the chicks and the piggies and we saw some cute piglets that were born like 20 days ago so that was quite nice so but yeah Edward was loving all the little farm animals and it has been all right although I am still miffed off about the £9.50 to get in like I said it did not mention it all in the handbook I'm going to double check that when I get home but I really don't think it did what are you two up to there's a guinea pig there's a guinea pig where oh yeah oh, we didn't see him before did we no it looks like mine there's another one as well you seen the other one there's two are you liking the farm what was your favorite animal pig the pig which one the one that came charging yeah <laughs> there was a black pig up there and it proper like got spooked by one of like the chicks or something or i don't know what it got spooked by but it came charging at the gate and I all the kids all the kids it. found it hilarious especially edward he was just amazed by the pig charging around grunting so we're just gonna head up to the house now and the little stable yard and then the kids we parked near the big adventure playground so we'll probably finish off there so yeah it's been nice so far just walking around hasn't it tids yeah. she had a haircut yesterday doesn't she look beautiful mm. so but it's just been really nice to see edward's little reactions to like all the animals it's been really he's cute been staring at them, like... mm. he loved the chicks didn't he yeah. Go. Don't put your hands too near him because he might get you. Close your eyes, get out of your skin. All it is matter, let it in. Okay, so they're your favourite too. If I could, I would be right here with you. In this world of ticking clocks, I hope I'm getting through. gardens at Tatton Park and they're just gorgeous and you don't have to pay for the gardens and the mansion if you are a National Trust member so we're just walking around the gardens now and then we're going into the mansion and it's just really nice again just really nicely set out some gorgeous flowers and yeah it's just a really lovely day turning out to be a really lovely day again into my mind. They have come in here for a bit of peace because Tom's been Marty, hasn't he? He's been a Marty old sausage. He just doesn't get why we have to come well, look at her. So nice. You just had some chocolate, haven't you? But Thomas is just a funny age, I think. If you've got a 10 year old, nearly 11 year old, have they got like the hormonal moves? He's 11 in October. I know, he's 11 like soon, isn't he? But he's just so grumpy, isn't he? I have to wait longer than him. 
Um, but Thomas is just being a grumpy old sausage. And every time we come to one of these places, it just whinges and moans. And you really like it, don't you? You're having a really nice time, aren't we? In the farm we and stuff. Some pigs. We saw some smelly pigs. But yeah, if you've got a 10, 11 year old, do you have this? Do they get some hormones at this age? Because seriously, he is being one grumpy moose. So Daddy is just outside this little greenhouse thing feeding Edward and we left Thomas there, didn't we? So we're gonna have a look around, aren't we? This is a new bed. <laughs> it does look better, it? I'll just lay them on them. They're really pretty. Well, they're, they're called. I think they're them dip. 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 Land your Sundays. Should we see if Thomas is still being grumpy? There he is, the we hormonal Horace. Stop the clocks, the bees are humming In between the contrasts of our souls oh, 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 oh. garden has got to be the most gorgeous garden that we've been to yet at a National Trust property. It's just so lovely and gorgeous. It's like the house and like it just goes on and on. It just seems to go on forever. bench playground we didn't actually end up going in the mansion this time and um, the kids are really ratty and tired so me and mr h are just gonna come another day and just do the mansion ourselves it's not worth it with crabby children is it put my glasses on so i can see better so me and edward are just waiting outside the park for the kids and yeah it's been a nice it is a nice place it's massive like we didn't do all of the garden because it literally goes like on for miles and like I said the kids are just really tired so they're just playing in the playground and then we are going to head home Oh. Mm -hmm. 